Are you asking her to tell you this on the record right now, Attorney Baldiga? Um, I would respect that if you prefer to do that privately. I would respect that. Um, but I am making that request. Well, I, I'm not. Court would respect that. If, if there, I want to know why this person is just, is not uh, no longer qualified. And if you have to file it under seal, file it under seal. But I think it's unacceptable to have proceeded this way and to w withdraw the appointment and not disclose to anyone what the reason is. And and I, as I have said, and I will say again, Mr. Whiteley accepted that appointment and filed documents under penalty of perjury in this case that he was a disinterested person. So I, you know, I don't agree that that this form over substance order needs to have entered for him to have. He's already posted a bond. So are you saying that the bonding company is going to say that the bond doesn't go into effect until there's an order entered? Well, that's interesting because that doesn't happen in Chapter Seven and Chapter Thirteen cases. Your Honor, to my knowledge, uh, Mr. Wiley has not posted a bond. Okay. All right. What time did I say we're going to have this hearing tomorrow? 3 p.m. All right. So you can all reach out to the courtroom deputy and um, obtain the information for the hearing and I want to hear what the progress is and I want to know how long it's going to take because it's been 20 days since that order that everyone insisted needed to enter right away and it did and and we still don't have a trustee anyone else have any questions okay that concludes today's hearing thank you thank you court is adjourned <laughs>